A web browser is a tool you use to access the Internet. In order to make the most out of the Internet, it's important to understand the basics of using a web browser. There are many different web browsers, including Chrome, Safari, Firefox, and Internet Explorer. All of them allow you to view websites, but they each have a different look and feel, so picking one will depend mostly on your personal preference. Right now, I'm using Chrome. When you open your browser, at the top of the window, you'll see the address bar. This is where you'll type the web address of the page that you want to visit. If you've been to a website before, your browser may suggest it, or even automatically complete the address for you. If you see the address you're looking for in the suggestions, you can just click it, or press enter when you're done typing. Most of the time, you're going to go from one page to another by clicking on links. To go back to the page you were just on, you can click the back button. To return to the first page, click the forward button. If you see a link that you want to click but you don't want to navigate away from the page that you're on, you can open the link in a new tab. Just right click the link and select Open in New Tab. This opens the page behind the current page so it doesn't take you away from the original site. You can also create a new tab by clicking here and then typing in the address or name of any site you want to visit. To close a tab, just click the X. If you're on a website that you know you'll want to visit again later, or a website that you go to frequently, you can bookmark it. Most browsers have a button right next to the address bar that lets you easily bookmark any site. Once you've bookmarked a page, you'll be able to go to it again. In Chrome, you'll click the Settings button, select Bookmarks, and then select the website you're looking for from the list. Even if you don't bookmark a site, there's still a way to find it again later. Your browser keeps track of all the websites you visit in a feature called History. All browsers allow you to access your history. In Chrome, you can access this by clicking the Settings button. You can then click on a site to go to it. And, as you may remember from before, you can begin typing in the address bar and your browser will make suggestions. These suggestions come from your history and bookmarks. The locations of these buttons and other options may vary a little depending on which browser you're using, but you should be able to perform all of the same actions no matter which browser you decide to use.